Hey and welcome everybody to the webinar for the Faculty of Public Affairs. We do this in basically two parts. First part is I'm going to speak about the faculty overall, kind of how we fit together. And then you're going to have the opportunity to hear from almost all of the programs that are offered by units in the Faculty of Public Affairs, have a chance to ask questions of all of them, have a chance to have general questions where somebody else from the university can help answer. So without further ado, maybe we could go to the next slide. Great, so I think what this tells you now essentially is what we are in the Faculty of Public Affairs. So all in all, there are 12 academic units in the faculty. Those that are highlighted on the screen are the ones where uh, bachelor's programs are offered. So the kinds of programs that you're considering right now are offered in all of those units. The other thing I want to highlight is the fact that we have all in all about 8,000 students in the faculty. About 6,500 of them are enrolled in bachelor's programs. So it is a big faculty that includes a large number of programs and a lot of different types of programs. Again, the, I know that you're you know, choosing a university, choosing a program of study is a really complicated set of questions to answer, and especially in these times uh, that we're facing now. But I want to assure you that all of us here in the Faculty of Public Affairs are in your corner. We want you to succeed. We want you to come to us and kind of learn from us and participate in who we are. And at the same time, we want you, uh, for you to be successful. I want to make sure that you know that all of the first year courses that you'll be taking this year, this fall, will be offered remotely. So that means that it will be offered through the internet. There will be no courses offered here on campus at Carleton. So, you, but you will receive the same high quality education uh, from these courses right from the safety of your own home. So this is kind of who we are, is what we are. And the next slide is about who we are. And so this basically brings together five big ideas around which the faculty uh, coalesces. So if you ask people around, what are we all about? Who do we, what kind of ideas do we identify with? Those are those ideas. So the first one has to do with governance and public policy. Almost all of our programs have major elements as part of them that study in one way or another the role of government in our societies. And so that kind of sets apart the programs of the Faculty of Public Affair, Affairs from other programs offered at Carleton. Many of our students uh, studying in the, are studying in these areas very intensively. A lot of our alumni, as you would expect, are in fact working directly in this area. You can't be too surprised at that. After all, we are in Ottawa. It is Canada's capital. It is a huge advantage for us. We can talk about this a little bit later. It means that a lot of the professors that you will be working with have close partnerships with different government agencies or departments. They have close partnerships with some non-governmental organizations or international uh, societies that are headquarters he, headquartered here in Ottawa. And basically, you have to remember, uh, the diplomatic community is essentially in our backyard. Basically, embassies and high commissions are here in Ottawa. Number of our programs have built special relationships with either some or a large number of these embassies and high commissions. And it kind of is a way of enriching the experience that you can have when you come to us. Second big idea, or second and third big idea, our focus on building a better society and building better democracy. So for us, fundamentally, our students are interested in making a difference in the world. That's the kind of student that comes to programs offered by the Faculty of Public, Public Affairs. Students, you will learn how to make a difference in the world, how to improve our societies, how, how to work for to enhance uh, de democracy. There's a number of ways in which for that you can do this. First of all, two examples that come to mind are the placements 
and the practicums that are available through our Bachelor of Social Work and the Bachelor of Arts in Criminology and Criminal Justice. Both groups really work hard to build linkages in with, the, with their communities and therefore give you some experience right in, to make a difference in our societies right within the program. Next big idea is about informed citizenships. It's citizenship. So bachelor's degrees really are helping you develop a sense of what it means to be an active citizen of your city, of our pro your province, or our country. So this is a way essentially of taking what you learn and applying it across, uh, across your areas of interest. Finally, we are about addressing regional and global challenges. And that means for us, international learning experience are an integral part of what we do in the Faculty of Public Affairs. And in preparation for the fall terms and the limitations that we're facing as a result of that, Professors have been working to modify courses so that this experience can be achieved at home without traveling internationally. So there's no need for you to fear that you're going to have to have it, to have to go abroad in order to develop some kind of, ex, of uh, experience, at least for the fall term. Next slide, please. Thank you. So now in a very highly creative way, we have put all the programs together as to which building uh, the department or the unit that offers the program uh, is located. So what you have before you first is Richcraft Hall. This is the our newest building in the Faculty of Public Affairs. All of the programs that you see listed here are offered either through the School of Journalism and Communication, that's the Bachelor of, of uh, Communications and Media Studies, the Bachelor of Journalism, the Bachelor of uh, Media Production and Design, or the Institute of European Russian and Eurasian Studies, the BA in uh, European and Russian Studies. You'll have the opportunity to learn more about all of these programs later on in this session. Next slide, please. So this is basically the, the low building is essentially where the faculty uh, used to be at its core in a sense that most of the units started here and then spread across the faculty across the, the the university. So as you can tell, a number of programs are headquartered in the low building. Again, you'll have the opportunity to, to learn about all of these programs. Uh, the, later on in this presentation, everything from criminology and criminal justice to law to uh, economics, political science, uh, all of these programs will be discussed later on in the session. And finally, the last building in which uh, Faculty of Public Affairs uh, programs are headquartered is the Dunton Tower. The, we have brand new facilities that people will be moving into over the course of the summer for the Bachelor of Global and International Studies. And then the Bachelor of Social Work uh, basically has all of its facilities, including research labs and stuff like this, uh, in the Dunton Tower. So this, what's particularly interesting about the Dunton Tower is it has a beautiful view of the campus, of the Rideau Canal, of Dow's Lake and of the Rideau River. So it is kind of a, a re, an interesting way of seeing the city but also, and the university within its geographical context. 